Hello everybody, my name is Charlie LaRich from the Lincoln Electric Company. I'm the supervisor of the welding school here in Cleveland, Ohio. And if you're excited like I am for this eclipse coming up on April 8th, I wanna make sure everybody's protected safely. So what we're gonna to do today is we're gonna show you how to take the auto darkening lens out of your helmet and put in a passive lens of a shade 13 or higher. That is an ISO 12312-2 um, code that they have for that, okay? So we're gonna show you how to swap this out real quick. What you're gonna to wanna to do is push these clips in, lift this up a little bit, right here, this will come right out. Then what you wanna do is just pop this out and you got these little brackets on the left or right here. You're going to slide this inside there, makes it a lot easier to pop this out to do that. What these brackets are for is a cheater lens so you can see better when you're welding. There we go. Now we have that in there. Okay. Now we're going to slide these clips on top back into the top there. Then we're going to slide these back over here to the left or right. Now what I would recommend, because when you look at the Eclipse, this may darken up your lens. Now you have a, a depending on where your lens is set at, you have a, I have a 14 lens in here, it's gonna darken up. I would hit the grind mode over here, so, the, so your auto darkener lens doesn't grind, uh, it's on grind mode and it won't darken up on you now. The auto darkener is a great helmet for welding. That's what it was intended for you for viewing through, okay, when you watch yourself welding. Uh, the, the, the eclipse is a phenomenon that's, gonna, that's coming up on April 8th again, just to remind everybody. Um, ISO 12312-2 recommends a fixed shade. So if you have your fixed shade in here of a 13 or higher, you are safe to view the eclipse, and that's what, that's what I'm recommending. So uh, thank you for viewing. Uh, again, I'm Charlie LaRich, Supervisor of the Welding School here at Lincoln Electric. Thank you.